What's up everybody? Today we're going to be playing a brand new game called A Story About My Uncle. I know nothing really about it except that it's a visually good looking game. I actually got to play a little bit of it before I realized that my recording uh, setting was off so I didn't get to keep that footage at all so I'm going to be replaying about the first hour. So I really hope you guys enjoy this. It's going to be a pretty short series I think and I really hope you enjoy it. I'll see you guys in just a second. Dad? Aren't you sleeping yet? It's time for bed, honey. Dad, I can't sleep. Can you tell me a bedtime story? All right. What do you want to hear? Something... something about an adventure. Hmm. I think I know just the thing. I love bedtime stories. Age, my biggest dream was to follow my Uncle Fred on one of his adventures around the world. One day, he disappeared. Okay, so we just get kind of thrown into it. Typical WASD. I stepped into the lobby of my uncle's house. It lay just across the hill from where I lived with my mother, your grandmother. She had tried to keep me from going, but I wanted to see. See if Fred was home yet from his latest adventure. Huh. Daddy's helmet. Are we playing Bioshock again? Is that what's going on? Ah, oh, look at the kitty. I've always wanted one of those. My uncle used to send me postcards from his long journeys. Greetings from Nepal, Galapagos, Kilimanjaro, the Amazon River. This was the first time he had left without a word. Without sending cards. Hmm. Looks like he's been all over. Mr. Fred. What is this? Beautiful. Okay. I have visited Uncle Fred's house countless of times. But in the locker, which usually was closed, I found something I hadn't seen before. It was an adventure suit. It resembled the one that Fred used, but smaller in size. Hmm. Curiosity got the better of me, and I tried it on. It fit like it had been custom made for me. There we go. Now we have the suit on with a nice little Hello Kitty looking bandage on the finger there. I don't know if you saw that. That was a grappling hook. Okay. Ooh, I like that door. The most mysterious room of my uncle's house was the observatory. There he kept his newest experiments, and right now it held a pad used for disposing of garbage. Uncle Fred had warned me not to touch any of his things, but as I said, I was a curious child. <laughs> Finding target, found target, opening dome. What? Who's the target? Oh. Well, hello there. Oh, whoa. I can't move. Oh, shoot. I guess we're going to space. Let's do it. Oh, what? What is this? A story about my uncle. I like the intro. It's very good. Very, very, uh, sets the tone, I think, pretty well. Whoa. What? I it with a crash, but thanks to the suit, I wasn't hurt. I had no idea where the pad had taken me, but back then, I didn't care so much about where I was going, or how I would get home. It's 11.46 on that one. I don't know what that is. Just a bunch of trash bags. All right. Progress. Okay, so these are like the little save marks. It does it automatically, which is good. The suit 
protected me from falls on the ground, but not in water. I couldn't swim with this thing on. Whew. Best be careful. Okay, so water we can't go into, which is everything down there. And it's almost like this place has less gravity. I mean, look at that. That's cool. Oh, gosh. Uh, whoa. Hmm. There we go. Very nice. I like the I like the level design. This is interesting. It's not like anything else. It's very simplistic, but okay. Oh, cool. So we have like a double jump almost. I was sure that someone had been here before me. Someone had built these bridges and carved these symbols, but who? Oh. Where were they now? Oh. Charge up the suit and then sprint for a power leap. There we go. I thought I had it. I think I had the same problem the first time I played this. Oh, well, duh. Okay. Okay, so they don't tell you to hold shift when, I mean, it just told you to press forward to sprint, but it didn't tell you to press shift at the same time. See, like that's sprinting. So now I have to charge it up and sprint. And I didn't make it still. So I'm wondering if uh, I just let go of, there we go. Just got to let go of the mouse button and then it'll power jump you all the way. Okay. So, let's just, oh crap. <laughs> it's going to be a lot of this tonight. Oh, so I have to go all the way back here. There we go. What is this? Oh, okay. So these are little collectibles. Cool. Come on. I have to say, when I saw this game on Steam, I knew right away that I was going to have to buy it. Awesome. So, if they want us to go over there, what's over here? I honestly don't even know that I can make it over there yet. I think I have to have the grappling ability. Which comes pretty soon, I think. Okay, so now this is a charge up jump. Whoa. Got it. Very pretty. Oh god, didn't make it. Did not make that. Damn it. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, which way? Oh, this way. Hopefully we make it this time around. Oh yeah, got it that time. Okay, I guess they want me to go there. Oh god, don't, don't, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, damn it. All the way back here. <laughs> Overshot that just a tad. Good thing for fast forwards, right? It's one of the best parts about recording. Okay, thank you. Uh, I don't know why I fail at these so bad sometimes. Come on. All right. Got it. Progress saved. Whoa. The power core I found 
activated the suit's grappling device when I picked it up. It must have been left here by my uncle. Huh. Okay. So that's that's the grapple. And it kind of pulls us along with gravitational pulls. Okay. Cool. And the thing will light up when I'm in range to grapple. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh god, what am I doing? <laughs> uh, there we go. The grappling device left a sort of symbol everywhere I grappled. I noticed similar symbols already there in the cave. And I was getting more and more certain that this place was where Fred had gone. Okay, by releasing that, you will fly forward. Yeah. Okay. That's if we don't hit our head on the rocks. I had that problem when I played it too. So we gotta like, time it. Just like that. Okay. Now we gotta time this one. Uh, okay, we got, got it, got it, got it. Cool. Combine power jump and the grapple to reach higher areas. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Combining power leap and the grapple will let you reach far off areas. The adventure okay. suit was fantastic. By combining a power leap with the grapple, I could fly long distances Damn. through the air at great speed. There we go. Oh god, that was a little bit close. Okay, so I think they want me to go there. Got it. Okay. Uh, got it, got it, got it. Oh god. Too far. Well, that works. That works just as well, right? Good enough for me. Okay, so... There we go. When grappling a moving object, you will follow along, okay? And I hear another one of those little collectible things. I hear it. There it is. Got it. Cool. Got that. Very nice. All right. Got it. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Uh, I think we gotta get over here. And we did. Sweet. Okay. Now I gotta figure out where they want me to go from here. Just take a guess. Uh, okay. Alright, so I guess we have to latch on to that. Kind of weird. But whatever. Maybe? Looks a little, a little far off. 
Where do they want me to go? Oh gosh, I did not want to just fall off the edge. I think I'm supposed to go there. Question, okay, maybe that's grapplable. Uh, yep, got it. Alright, so I think we have to get up there, which is that rock. I have to use that rock to get up there. <laughs> All right, I think we got it. Ooh. Second power core. Okay, so now we have two different two grapples. That's cool. That means we're going to have multiple jumps. Very nice. Okay, the lit thing on the hand indicates how many we have left. I see. Whoa. Really? Okay. And I made it. So basically it recharges whenever we hit the ground. That's cool. Alright. I hear another one of these things. There we are. Got it. Okay. Alright, so it looks like we gotta time this one to match up with that rock. I think we got it. Whoa. Okay. So it looks like we gotta go up there. Damn, I think I was supposed to get on the second rock. Should take me there. Yep, got it. Uh, it's over here. Another collectible. Did you ever see any of Fred's experiments yourself? Yes, I actually helped him collect samples for his research sometimes. To learn about them? That's right. We found all sorts of things. One time, we went to the forest and found a small pool of water that was full of eggs. Eggs? Were there chickens in the forest? No, not chicken eggs. These were small and jelly-like. Hundreds of them. Fred told me that they were frog eggs. He was in for a surprise though. Guess what happened? What? What happened? Well, we took some eggs back home and one day Fred woke up with bites all over his body. Turns out, it wasn't frog eggs after all. It was mosquito eggs. Ah, oh, poor Fred. I know. He didn't nah, have real frog I messed eggs that up. eventually. He told me that they were very, very special. But I don't know what happened to them. Alright, so there's some type of a experimentation hatchling thing going on here. Alright, so it looks like we gotta do this again. Where we match... damn it. I hate when I double click. That always messes me up. Alright. Oh, I could just ridden this one. There we go. Oh wow, some lights. Looks like we... Ooh, that was close. Might see some civilization soon. 
lights. Hmm. These blue lights. Did Fred put them here? Or was somebody else here as well? Thank you.